Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. As Pokemon Geo lovers, we all want to explore the iTools BT, right? Well, now that we got our hands on it, it's time to check out how to really use it on our phones. So, let's dive in. To connect iTools to our phone, first, you need to download the modified app called iTools Drive or iTools B6. You can find it in the iTools official articles or their support page. Pick whichever version you can access and you're good to go. Now, long press the power button until the notification light turns on. If it blinks red, that means the battery is low, charge it first, or it won't be available to use. Once it's on, go to Bluetooth settings on your iPhone, then connect to the device that ends with C-O-R-E. When the light stops blinking, that means it's successfully connected. Now, open iTools Drive. Tap the Bluetooth icon and connect it again within the app. Then, you're ready to go. Just tap or search for the place you want to go, and it will show you the details. Once you teleport, you'll see that it's pretty quick and the location is updated on the map. All right, after teleporting, we can open Pokemon Geo to check the new location. Looking good. Now, we can start using the joystick to move around. If you want to adjust your speed, tap the first icon here and change it. You can also set a route for auto walking. Also, you can set button functions here, but be careful with the GPX button while playing. If you tap it, it will instantly send you straight back to the set location, and that could be easily detected. But here's something to keep in mind. If you upgrade your iOS version, the app won't work anymore, and you'll have to reinstall the app again. So, the app itself is pretty simple, and the physical joystick feels smooth, but one downside is that it doesn't let you search for Pokemon or Pokestop directly. If you have a computer, I'd recommend trying iAnyGo instead. It also connects via Bluetooth, but has way more features. All right, that's it for today. If this video helped you, drop a like, subscribe, and let me know in the comments if you have any questions. See you in the next one.